The 68th all-time meeting of this game is underway with a ball out of the zone from Zabel. Losses as much as this past week did. Moore slices one to right field towards the corner. That's going to get down. Could be extra bases for Moore. On his way to second, stops there with a leadoff double. Well, he just shows you the versatility of his barrel. You know, a, a good... Full count again to McLean. A swing and a miss, struck him out. Foul tip strikeout. Minchie's first punch out tonight. Swung on, up the middle, bouncing ball. Gloved by Daly, throw to first base is in time for the out. Mitchell Daly, a veteran defensive infielder. Makes a good play from short. Ground ball back to Daly. Routine play to first is made, and the Bobcats can't do anything with the leadoff double. A strikeout for Zabel, his second of the game. And he has retired four in a row, two down here in the top of the inning. That's inside. A two-out walk, second walk given up by Zabel. That ball swung on to left. Gonzalez coming in and can't make the catch. O'Dowd over to third base, Daly to second. Two on, two out for Texas here in the top of the inning. One, two. That ball headed towards center field, right to McLean in Texas, strands two. Some two out trouble for Zabel, but no runs come home. This game still scoreless. A swing and a miss. Good velocity there from Menchi, his second strikeout. Ramirez with a ground ball through the right side for a one out base hit. Texas State's second hit of the game. A man on with one out now for Peyton Lewis. Instead, draws a walk. First walk given up by Minchie. Behind one and two. Strikes out here. Third strikeout for Kobe Minchie in his first career start. Slowly waking up, starting to make better contact. There you go. A base hit up the middle for Jared Thomas. Starts to Texas third. I got a, an impressive looking freshman from Waxahachie, Texas. Now his average up over 300. That ball headed towards center. That's going to drop for a base hit. Thomas puts on the brakes at second. Back-to-back -back singles for the Longhorns here to start the third inning. Grounded, fair. Pena will go to first as Powell advances the runners to second and third, and there's one away. Full count from Zabel. Struck him out for a second time. From behind, three balls and no strikes to a strikeout. Big pitch there from Peyton Zabel. They're gonna put him on. They will. So an intentional walk to Brown. Loads him up now for Ryland Galvan. He misses outside. RBI walk, Ryland Galvan. That'll bring home Jared Thomas in Texas on top, 1-0. Well, that's a good take by that's Young right, hitter right there. Galvan, that ball not very far off the edge of the plate. I think so. Ground ball, left side and through for a base hit for O'Dowd. That's going to bring in two. Campbell scores. In comes Porter Brown. 3-0, Texas on top. Well, O'Dowd, it, 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 remember now, that base is loaded. He goes after an 0-0 pitch and takes a really aggressive swing. They try to go away with him. They come back to try to go away again. They're in the shift defense now where the shortstop's back up the middle. A swing and a miss and struck him out. After they just scored. Morris strikes out. What an outing so far for Kobe Minchie. One, two from Minchie. He's got a piece of that, rolls into third, charging in Powell, throw to first base, pull Thomas off the bag. And the inning extends here for Texas State. And that nearly hit him. It did hit him. So Gonzalez trying to get out of the way, couldn't. That ball lined right to Powell at third base, a great snag in the hot corner, and the Bobcats strand two. Huge for college baseball. Medrano strikes out Campbell and faces the minimum. Well, for him moving forward, it's a big night for him. Ramirez a liner right to Thomas at first. The last two outs the Bobcats have hit. They were probably going to script this out. Hernandez, ball towards center, long run. Campbell makes the catch on the run for Texas. <laughs> and, and, you know, there's... There's more stories that, you know, compl <laughs> compliance, you know, now that they're not involved anymore can, can hear about, but people. It was a really good team, but the, the number of at-bats. As a player throughout this program. 
Man, just, just so many. Just so many. There's a great pitch right there. Facing Galvan and strikes him out for that franchise. Manning with a fly ball to right. That's going to land for a base hit. Got it over the shift in right field for a leadoff single. 2-2. Two -two. On the inside corner, breaking ball. Got him strike three. First strikeout out of the pen for Toll. Around here. 2-2. Two -two. Here's a fly ball to center. Campbell drifting over to his left. And he's going to make the catch in front of Whitehead. Draws a leadoff walk. Gonzalez on for the second time. Fly ball to left, setting into foul territory. Here's Brown on the run. Stops at his tracks and makes the catch. Gonzalez has to get back to first, and he's doubled off. What a play. I mean, Porter Brown goes all the way to the fence, has to kind of break down as the ball starts to drift in, catch that ball, spin and throw all the way back over to first base to double up Gonzalez. What a cannon here from Porter Brown. Gonzalez got too far off the base and pays for it. We go to the seventh, three nothing. Texas on top. It pretty similar to what he did at center. Ground ball to short, tough play for Powell. Campbell's got speed. Pena digs it out for the first out of the seventh inning. Two and two from Adrano. A swing and a foul tip strikeout. Powell down on strikes. In relief from Adrano. Got him. A swing and a miss and struck him out. Medrano fired up. A swing and a miss. Struck him out. What a performance by Medrano. That ball hit well to left. Going to drop in for a base hit. Going to bounce off the wall. Galvan is second base with a one-out double. He catches one of the few rare hanging breakers. Yep, pinch hitter for Texas, Cam Constantine. And Constantine draws a four-pitch walk. This ball is hit towards right center field. Tough play for the Bobcats, and a diving catch made by Cade Manning. Wow. A Superman effort out in right field. Rob Staley of a base hit. You, me, and everybody else had our eyes watching Ben McClain. And the camera angle's watching Ben McClain. Watch him. He's coming in. He's not going to be able to get there. Now watch it the last minute in your picture. Watch Kate Manning full laid out and makes an unbelievable catch. Swung on. Left field and a base hit down the line. Flores delivers. That'll bring home the Longhorns' fourth run of the night. Could be a fifth run. Coming in to scores to Plantier. Two-run double. Jalen Flores, it's 5-0 Texas. Now we were just talking about how this is one of their good looking young hitters. They really believe this guy's got a tremendous career ahead of him. Coach Pierce making a move, going away from the left hand and hitting wide head, going to, to Jalen at that point. He comes up with a big time hit. And then DePlantier, who comes in as a pinch runner. Mm -hmm. so you have a good relationship with Greg Swindell. In fact, something we haven't talked about is Thomas draws a walk. Swindell was on your staff for a year. Pinch hit double from Jalen Flores. Grab ball to short, vacuumed up by Powell. Good pick by Pena at first, and we go to the bottom of the eighth. With two outs. That ball down the line, that's fair. Ben McClain with a leadoff base hit here in the eighth inning. Motors on his second, and a good start for the Bobcats who trail by five. That got a piece of the equipment of Powell. Swing and a miss and struck him out. Big pitch from Stewart. Gonzalez climbs a ladder and comes up empty. Struck him out looking. Back-to-back -back strikeouts from Stewart. Fly ball, right center field. Well hit to Plantier going back. And that ball is going to drop in for a base hit. Going to score two. Here's McLean. Leary to third base behind McLean and scoring his pal. Ryan Leary, a pinch hit, 2-1 triple. It's a new game. Well, it definitely is a new game, and he didn't waste any time. Thought he was going to get a first pitch fastball. He certainly ambushes the first one he sees, and you've got to have some power to drive that ball. That ball's to the deep side of the park right there as it hits at the base of the fence. It's the big right-hander. Walks Lewis, and that'll bring up the tying run. 
2-2 again. Swing and a miss and struck him out. Get back out there. Base hit up the middle, no. Bobcats in the shift. Mora from behind the bag at second makes the play. Make that Davis Powell. Beg your pardon, in the shift. Teams are very aggressive on their shifts. That gets a piece of Gilmet. Grab ball to short. Powell for out number two to Pena. Moves Gilmet to third. Again, he was the one who made that play in the shift earlier in the inning. Powell challenged again here. No problem. Again, a really aggressive shift of three infielders on the right side. And Manning pulls one towards the shift. Easy play for Thomas and one down at the bottom of the ninth. Full count to Moore again. Fly ball, left field, well hit. Brown at the track, makes a catch to shine the wall. Two and two to McLean. Swing and a miss, struck him out, Morehouse. His second strikeout of the game, and the Longhorns take the series opener. Five to two in front of a record crowd here in San Marcos. Mm -hmm.